One thing chefs are great at is looking around at what's available and utilizing it. One of the ways we do that is by making soups. But another way that we do it, especially in the summer months, is by making salads. Now I've talked before on here about utilization salads, but today I wanna to go really in depth on one. So I'm gonna start with the quinoa, and I know I wanna use up this red pepper and cilantro, and I'm looking at what else I have to use up in the refrigerator, and I want some nice crunch, I want some fresh, bright flavors. So I go to cucumber, I go to radish, and then I see some watermelon, and now things are going next level. So we're gonna dice all these things up, we're gonna throw in some green onions, I've got some feta cheese, that pairs excellently with watermelon. Put all these things together, nice and small, because quinoa is small, and I want this whole salad to be not homogenous, but kind of on the same playing field. We're gonna mix it all together. I'm gonna to add a little bit of oil to it and a little bit of vinegar just for that pop and that flavor. We're gonna pour in the watermelon juice that was left over with the watermelon chunks. Mix it all together, add a little salt, a little crushed red pepper to get a bit of heat to all that sweet. And boom, we have a fantastic side dish or even a main. This is going to be very healthy, very hearty. It's gonna be filling and it's good for you. All that food that was rotting and going south in your fridge, now it looks great in this salad and it's gonna feel great going down into your tummy. So guys, don't be afraid to try some things out and don't be afraid of your food. You can make a utilization salad out of almost any grain or starch. You can just think of a three bean salad, you can think of a potato salad, or you can go more in the direction that we went today where we had this quinoa and we added a bunch of color to it. You know, good food is beautiful. If you're not sure if something will go together, take a little of what you have and a little of what you wanna to add to it, try it together in your mouth at the same time. You're gonna know right away if it tastes right or not. Do you have any ingredients at home that are throwing you for a loop or anything you've seen in the grocery store you're not sure what you do with? Just let me know what it is and I'll show you something. We can do great things with food together. Don't be afraid to smash that subscribe button.